Business Report now happening today, the much anticipated vote on the president's plan to take control of the internet. Ashley Webster from our sister network, Fox Business, is here to explain exactly how it could impact you. Ashley? Yes, Heather and Ainsley, good morning. Your eyes, well, they may start to glaze over a little bit when you look at the FCC's 332-page plan on net neutrality, but ultimately it comes down to this. It means an intercept and internet service provider should not demand a uh, company like Netflix to pay more to get their content delivered to consumers faster. But what does it mean to you, the consumer? Well, here are some of the arguments. A key issue is the cost. Internet service providers claim if the FCC treats broadband like a utility, it could raise fees, which in time will be passed on to consumers. The FCC says it won't happen, but critics say, haha, that could change. Supporters say the new regulations would help to maintain a level playing field for future internet startups who could otherwise be priced out. But also, if approved, net neutrality would ensure consumers could access everything and not allow ISPs to pick and choose content. But critics argue that greater regulation may lead to less investment in infrastructure that could benefit all of us. And by the way, even if the FCC approves the plan today, which is expected, the next stop on this issue will likely be the courts. So don't hold your breath. Ainsley, back to you. <laughs> I won't. Thank you, Ashley. Sure. Well, to find Ashley, you can always find him on the Fox Business Network. And in order to find that on your channel, you can log on to foxbusiness.com slash channel finder.